In the Bosnian capital, Sarajevo, workers made final preparations at the city's Olympic Stadium, ahead of a one-day visit by Pope Francis on June the 6th. Some 50,000 people are expected to attend the service at which the pontiff will pray for peace and interreligious dialogue. A bell made in Croatia for the Pope's visit was blessed by Bosnia's cardinal and installed at the stadium. In the Tajik capital, Dushanbe, interior ministers of Shanghai Cooperation Organization member states met to discuss security issues. The ministers named terrorism, extremism and separatism as the most serious threats facing their countries and addressed the growth of the Islamic State militant group. The Shanghai Cooperation Organization comprises China, Kazakhstan, Kyrgyzstan, Russia, Tajikistan and Uzbekistan. In Banu, in northwest Pakistan, a fire swept through a tent city, housing displaced people from the North Waziristan tribal area. Two women were reported injured in the blaze. Around a million people have been displaced by military operations against Taliban militants in North Waziristan in the past year. In the Kyrgyz capital Bishkek, members of a nationalist party gathered signatures on a petition calling for the death penalty for paedophiles. Kyrgyzstan currently does not sentence criminals to death for any crime. A rising number of cases of sexual abuse of children in recent years has prompted growing alarm and calls for harsher punishments. And that's the video roundup from Radio Free Europe, Radio Liberty.